Everyman Driver Nation, welcome inside the 2015 Ford Edge Sport all-wheel drive. Hi, I'm Dave Erickson. We're here at the 2015 Northwest Outdoor Activity Vehicle of the Year competition on road and off. Today we are on road at an airfield. This is a closed course. We're going to be testing four different criteria, a parking test backing up, then a slalom through cones, braking, and then an acceleration test. Under the hood of this Edge is a 2.7 liter GTDI V6 engine made it to a six speed automatic transmission. And I'm happy to say we are rolling on 20 inch polished aluminum wheels. So without further ado, let's start her up and put her in drive. So here's a quick look at the cabin and interior, specifically the center stack with this touchscreen LCD screen there. All your climate controls down below. We've got heated and cool seats right there. Fans, obviously. Let's see what else we have. Down here, we've got some USB inputs. Different driving modes here. Shifting. There are paddle shifters on the steering column itself. Here's a look at your instrument cluster, combination of digital and also some hard plastic indicators, steering wheel mounted controls, Bluetooth over here, cruise control, looking good. I'd love to hear your thoughts on this interior of the Edge. Leave your comments just below this video. Okay, we are safely on the airstrip and our first test is this backup parking test. And what we're hoping to find is that all the sensors around the car work, the backup camera works, and there's some kind of warning, audible, or visual to let us know if there's an obstruction behind us. So let me get in position here. Pop it in reverse. And there's our backup camera. Let's go ahead and find our way between the cones. I'm thinking we might get some visual alerts because before I've even done, the, done this, looks like there's some sensor shadows around the car. Okay, back up, back up, back up. There's a blow up dinosaur that's been blown down. Oh, there we go, look at that. Right there, cool. All right, it works. This is a good one. Put it back in drive. Let's move forward. Test number two, slalom through cones. We'll go about 20 miles per hour, nice and easy. Let the car do the work, all wheel drive. This feels good. This feels better than some of the cars I've driven today. Nicely weighted, and I'm going, oh, I'm actually going more than 20 miles per hour. It's even more impressive. All right, test number three is braking at 40 miles per hour. Full brake, here we go, three, two, one, brake. Nice, a lot of power and braking at the front. Didn't quite skid, it was a slow skid, even though uh, it didn't, you know, completely lock up, it was good. I think the stopping distance was right on par where, where every other vehicle has been today. So it's kind of hard to stand out when all the technology is really up to speed. Our final test is acceleration here, zero to 50 probably. Three, two, one, go. Oh, there's some kick to it. Holy crap, that was good. 50, 55, wow. I think we got maybe just over 4,000 RPM. That was powerful, more than I was expecting. Nice job, Edge. Looking good. Hey, that's gonna wrap it up for this uh, part one of our two-day event uh, in the Edge and other vehicles. Tomorrow we'll be off-road and we will have an entire playlist on YouTube dedicated to this event. So check it out. It'll be labeled probably 2015 Mudfest. 
And thank you for subscribing, supporting us, leaving comments below, thumbs ups, thumbs downs, liking us on Facebook. I appreciate all the support. I'm Dave Erickson. Thanks for watching. We will see you next time.